Well, hello mirrorunners. So, in this video, I'm going to share something that might be useful for you. Do you know what I'm going to share? Yeah, as you see the title of this video, I think you know what I'm going to share. I am going to share about how to take sunset and sunrise photos properly. Mirrorunners, if you are a photographer, while traveling, you definitely feel that photo of sunset and sunrise is one of many kinds of photos you should take, isn't it? I actually like to take photos of sunset or sunrise as well, due to not a photographer and only use smartphone camera. The photos of sunset and sunrise which I took look a little bit terrible. <laughs> Although the result of photos is not as good as I expected, I still try to learn how to take photos of sunset properly, even only use the smartphone camera. Okay, couple months ago, when I was in Aceh, I took some sunset and sunrise photos on Ulele Beach. So here is the photos. I have ever read an article on internet about tips to take sunset photos then I would like to share the tips to you guys hope they are useful for you so if you ever tried shooting sunset or sunrise photos but you are less satisfied with the result you might read these tips take photos of sunrise and sunset below so here we go number one do the observation first before taking pictures or taking photos sunset so that you will get a good spot to take pictures with good angle. Commonly, the observation should take several hours before taking a photo. Number 2. Use all your prepared equipment such as a tripod and use the natural density filter. Number 3. Set up your camera setting to fit the settings for shooting sunset or sunrise. Number 4. Look at the sky. When the sky begins to be golden, take the photo immediately. Don't need to wait any longer because this is the good time to get a dramatic photo where the intensity of light is not too much and gives a golden feel. Number 5. Take advantage of the silhouettes that arise from the rays of sunlight that touch clouds or other objects. By using silhouettes, the photos you get will look better, cool and more dramatic. Number 6. Note that position of the sun. Place the sun where you think it is good in the frame, so the results are interesting and unique. The last, number 7. Keep shooting! So that's all I can share. Hopefully this video is useful for you. Don't forget to share to your friends on your social media. I'm Miron Choki. See you next time. Always be my mirrorness.